Right, Darren, finally we have the first day of the season on Saturday. How are the boys looking going into this one? Certainly a good mood in the camp this morning. Training was obviously very bright and lively. I think they've waited long enough now and they're looking forward to the big kickoff tomorrow. Looking back at pre-season as a whole, how, do you, how successful do you feel it's been? Listen, it, if we come away with three points tomorrow, then straight away I'll be thinking it was a successful pre-season. Um, that's how we've approached it. We, we've, we've built up over these last four or five week period to hopefully make a positive start, build momentum. Um, there's obviously no guarantees, we know that. But with my intentions in pre-season was to get us fit and to get us playing some good football and getting goals. In that respect, I'm, I'm very, very pleased with how it's gone. Obviously, there's been one or two little niggles along the way, um, which has been a little bit frustrating for not only myself, but the, the individuals involved. But, you know, I've got 99% of my squad available for tomorrow and everyone's really excited and looking forward to the opening day. Do you sort of see your, you've had this as your first full pre-season as head coach, do you sort of see your philosophy coming through from those games that we've played over the past few weeks? I'd like to think so, you know, the, the, the boys understand what my values are, they understand how I want them to play. Um, you know, I think that they've they've bought in, in all fairness, they've, they've worked tirelessly every day, as expected of course, but they've certainly worked extremely hard, uh, so I can't fault them in that respect. And what I'm hopefully allowing, which I tried to implement last season as well, is a little bit of freedom in their play. They've got to enjoy their football. If, you, if you're happy in your workplace and you enjoy your football, straight away you're a better player. So we've installed a little bit of happiness into them. I'm hoping we've in, also installed a good work ethic in them. And now it's just about you know, starting the season well with momentum, being aggressive in our play, um, building up that momentum that you know, I, I do believe that if, if this group of players can start the season well and gain early momentum with confidence, it's going to be a difficult team to play against and a difficult team to stop. What, what are you expecting from the opposition? Because it's certainly not going to be an easy start. No, I mean, listen, in the first week we've got two teams that come down from League 2. So straight away that, that looks a, a, a difficult week ahead. But let's embrace it. There's nothing to fear. My, my, my biggest fear a lot of the time is how my own team's going to perform because I trust them as much as I do and I, I rate them the way I do. A lot of my efforts go into my own team and not the opposition. But I'll be going into tomorrow excited and looking forward to it, knowing that if we can produce the type of energy levels and the commitment and the aggression and the determination that I know they're capable of, it's going to be difficult for our opponent.